Foiled is a simulation of Olympic foil fencing, a card game distillation of the fast-paced sport of sparring blades and clashing minds for a pair of eager duelists. Players take simultaneous turns, selecting and revealing actions with a pair of cards. The king and queen represent offensive or defensive moves, respectively, while the numbered cards in ace allow movement, parries, and attacks. The game of fencing, however, is not only about what your opponent is doing, but also about where they're doing it. The jacks, each representing their player's fencer, move up and down the playing area, or pieced, with every action, and with each move the availability and strength of each option will change. Let's take a look. Fencer A wants to attack from the starting position. An attack can only succeed when the fencers are adjacent, but thankfully every attacking action includes some forward movement to help close the gap. Movement always takes place before attacks and parries. Fencer A can attack on one of three lines, four, six, or eight. An attack in four will move her forward one step, allowing her to attack if fencer B stays put. It will also beat out a slower attack by fencer B in the sixth or eighth line. However, if fencer B parries the attack in four, he creates an opening and scores a touch immediately with a riposte. Fencer A can choose to attack with the slower 6 instead, allowing her to avoid Fencer B's parry in 4, although she will be vulnerable to a faster attack in 4 herself. Of course, all this is for naught if Fencer B simply steps back, making attacks by Fencer A in both 4 and 6 fall short. Fencer A could defeat this tactic by launching an explosive attack in 8, moving her two steps forward and close enough to touch. If she exercises some patience, however, she can simply step forward, pushing Fencer B closer to the end of the piece and gaining the right of way. The right of way is a bonus conferred upon one fencer that allows them to break ties in their favor. You gain the right of way when one or more of the following conditions are met. You move forward on the same turn your opponent moves back or parries. Your opponent with the right of way does not move forward or attack. Your opponent attacks and does not score. If both fencers attack at the same speed while neither has the right of way, Neither scores, and their positions are reset. With the right of way, however, Fencer A scores the touch, and the competitors return to their on-guard lines to begin the next point. The first fencer to score five times is the winner.